Come on, Finn. It's Finn. Leave a message, and I'll listen to it eventually. It's Miles. I know I'm the last person you want to talk to right now, but you need to listen. Krieger updated the specs on the reactor. If you plug Unstable New Form into it... The length of your message has exceeded this user's limit. Please hang up and... <sighs> I'll call her later. Uh-oh. What's up, you guys? Welcome back. Oh, I feel like we're nearing the end, to be honest. Oh. Oh, this is the end. This is it. You guys ready? Because I'm ready. Let's go. You see him close renovation, and the underground moves right in. Finn's got to be inside. Hope I can be there to see the explosion. It'll change everything. Finn ran the city for years. After the plaza, we'll take its place. All right. Let's tag up all the enemies we could possibly find. Normally, I like taking out the snipers first. What is that on top of birds? Don't trust anyone who isn't underground. But I don't know if that's possible. Let's go along this railway. Maybe. I might just be able to take some of these guys out. Oh, I did not expect this guy to no, go up here. Big lab will rob some too. <laughs> Well, there you go, our first victim. <laughs> Second victim. Nice. Okay, so let me run up. Let me run around this rim. Let me try to get rid of those two guys back there. Probably gonna go invisible. Hold on. Let me check our skills before anything. So this is our skill tree that I've been maxing out little by little on my own. Um, next upgrade. What can we get? Oh, wow. Oh, we should probably see it, huh? <laughs> I'm over here. Blinding light. Ah, that's not bad. What does this bottom one do? Oh, I really cocoon them, to be honest. What does this do? OK, OK. Oh, OK, that's not bad. You know what? I'm going to take this one. Wait, wait, wait. What's this? Mega Venom Blast? Damn. Oh, it's a new game. What? That's whack. So they really expect you to play it over and over, huh? Get this one. This new game as well. Allows the third finisher to be back. Nice. I wonder what this one is. While climbing flash, the combo counter no longer resets and a bonus combo point is generated per attack. That's cool. Wow, what's this? These collectibles and stuff. Look at this whole map. There's a lot of like side stuff to do. You have the app activities. What do you have? It breaks down by regions. So there's a lot going on still that I need to work on, but I mean, I don't know. I thought the game was going to be a lot longer, to be honest. Or maybe it fell short because I've been enjoying it so much. So we got our suits. We don't have as many, to be honest. There's some that are still locked and this one says new game. How about mods? Can I buy another mod? I have a secondary mod. Oh, I can. I'm scan. I increase the window for perfect dodging. Ammo. That one looks cool. I think. I don't know if this is better. Unaffordable. What? I might unlock this one. Let's get this one. Gadgets. 
Can we upgrade our gadgets? Yes. Yes. No. No, we cannot. <laughs> Need to fight crime more. Skills. We're good at skills. Missions. I'm not sure what... Uh, why I have that notification, to be honest. All right. Let's get back to it. Where were we? Get away from me. No! Uh, gotta be quicker than that. And that's how it's done. <laughs> All right, let's get rid of the last few snipers. Let's go through the outer rim. Oh. Ah, it should be the last one. I could probably go ham on the other ones, to be honest. I don't think it matters. If I was able to survive the other one, why can't I survive this one? <laughs> should be safe to take this guy, but I'm out of range. Not no more. If I get this guy. Nope, out of range too. You guys ready? I'm about to go and ham on this guy. Sarah, how's it going, bro? Sarah. Someone check on him. I'll check around. <laughs> I was waiting for him to catch me. Alright, we're going in ham, you guys. It is going to be the end. Why waste time? Finish them. Time to rush. Oh, the first one to actually hit me. Ah, oh. <laughs> oh, they're getting better, you guys. Never. Double the trouble. Yeah, broke her back, you guys. <laughs> Alright, who else is left? Whoops. Let's see. <laughs> Alright. Oh, shoot. That was a little too risky. Should not play with guns. Same kind of barrier they had at Gym Theater. 
I need to drain the generators. In those shacks, which are locked and powered down. Need a new power source. Like that giant spinning mobile. <sighs> Alrighty. So I cleared the whole area without even knowing that I was going to have to, like, use these generators. But you know, how convenient. First, how to break this down. You have to link these, right? Question is how. How do I link them? This runs here. Oh, here's the connector. Break that. Bet I could web the nodes to the mobile. Conduct electricity. Just need the webs to reach. Webs won't reach. Yeah, this'll work. How? How would this work? It'll work for one of them. Maybe... Okay, there you go. That's the way. What do you guys think about this story? It's a little too short. I mean, they did say it was going to be a standalone, so I expected it to be short, to be honest. Oh, yeah. This will work. Need to wire it to the shacks. Just a little sad that it's a little too short. <laughs> It's the thing about these Spider-Man games. I love them so much that once I beat them, I get sad. Uh, I think it should be all of them. Nope. I'm missing one more. Wait, didn't I connect this you one? You two have to share. Pressing the wrong buttons. Oh, well, this is gonna work. This is working. All right. A couple more. Let's come get the last two. These probably gates open. I didn't realize it, huh? Wait, did they? So not here. Did this not work? Do my webs disappear after a while? Aw, oh, come on. Yes. Oh, whoops. One more. I saw one more. Can't believe how well this is working. Wait, this one's still tethered. Uh where is it? Where is this generator? Oh, it's not even here. Aha! No, 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 no. Again, the same thing. Oh, come on. made it you guys I was expecting to see more villains to be honest instead of um instead of just Rhino from Sinister Six
Oh, another tech box. Underground cash. Or cash, my bad. I'm missing like three more, which I probably missed. So they're hidden with admissions. Smart. Ben, come on. We need to finish this. You and me. She's got to be with our project down that hall. Oh, Finn. While we're still young. For tomorrow's innovation is today's reality. I'm coming, I'm coming. Hey, where'd they put us? I've got the museum map on my phone. Our project's in a special exhibit on the top floor. Can't wait to see our names on the little sign, like real scientists. Today, Oscorp Science Center. Tomorrow, every major museum in the world. Oh. Energy homes are the key to sustainable, healthy living beneath the sea. Commercial and industrial algae cultivation is already used in a number of products. I wonder what algae tastes like. Probably kale. Ugh, I hate kale. This model combines the design of a submarine with the deep sea integrity of an unmanned underwater vehicle. Oscorp's prototype would unlock new possibilities in humanity's ability to explore. <laughs> you and I gotta get one of these. Bet we could build one out of a vacuum cleaner and some old tires if we put our minds to it. Wow, oh, the future tech is here. Think underwater living sounds like science fiction? Think again. Underwater habitats have been used around the world since the 1960s. This model proposes a permanent residence beneath the waves. Today, New Yorkers are building up to save space. Tomorrow, we could be building beneath the sea. Pass. What, you scared? Of sharks, the dark, tiny enclosed spaces? It's a no for me. She's got my vote. I feel the same way. Especially because I don't know how to swim. <laughs> of the Earth's oceans remain unexplored and could be the next frontier in human habitation. It's weird to think how little we know about our own planet. Thanks for bringing me. I've never been here before. Gotta love oh, the spacesuit. This dive suit I'm, is one the of dive the suit, first I mean. developed in the early 18th century. The first pressure-proof diving suit was developed with salvage work in mind. Today's suits such as these are used by salvage workers, scientists, and explorers. Think they'll let me try it on? Would love to see you try to walk around in that thing. Can't be worse than those shoes you wore to the spring dance. Oh, come on. Yours were at least an inch higher than mine. <laughs> That's a pretty cool suit. Actually would make me want to scuba dive or deep sea dive. Ah, oh, we're at the museum, you guys. Special exhibits upstairs. There's the elevator. We've got time to look around first. All right, let's look around. I'll give you guys a tour. Don't worry, I got you guys. Government and privately owned spacecraft explore our planet, solar system, and galaxy. To communicate with them, scientists use radio antennas to send and receive messages across local and interstellar space. Oh, I bet the sound quality on these are dope. Not from space. True. I, it's, I still wonder how that works, actually, you know, like. Do you have tickets for the special exhibit? Oh, um, our project is on display. Didn't think we needed tickets. You do. And we're sold out. Can't let you go upstairs. Thanks anyway. Aw, oh, man. So we need another way in. She said there's no more tickets. Right, but see that space? door? 
the hallway behind it wraps around to the elevator. Can't just break in. We have to. They're taking down the exhibit tomorrow, and then we'll never see it. Let's see these like huge Land Rovers over here. This Osborne broker, adapted for models currently used on the moon, can be operated as a man or unmanned vehicle, used to carry minerals and find water sources. The Osborne broker would make exploration possible on Mars. Scans for minerals, carries people across toxic wastelands. What can't it do? Can you imagine driving this thing down fifth? Move, pedestrians. <laughs> Looks like this is the last one, you guys. Ooh, we got to play. Oh, come on. It's just button mashing. Oh. So you admit defeat? My specialty. Sorry, Finn. You're going to lose. Never. Oh, faster. Come on, rocket buddy. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Go, 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 go. Gotcha. Found something I'm better at than you. <laughs> Not for long. Sorry, Finn. Butter mashing is my my type of game. You ain't gonna beat me at that. Oh, there's one more. Architectural innovations are the key to human survival on extraterrestrial planets. This model home would protect human inhabitants from the low temperatures on Mars. Check it out. You want a house on Mars? Sure. If I could bring my mics, audio setup, sampler. They won't let you take all that. Why not? They will if they want good music on Mars. Oh, what's this? Using a shape memory alloy or memory metal, Oscorp scientists created this prototype of a metal that could change its shape while maintaining integrity. One day, memory metal could be used in many types of machinery and even in your own home. Whoa, check it out. Metal that changes shape. I like the idea, but it looks kind of basic. Bet it could be improved. Oh, yeah, definitely. The concept itself is pretty good. Oh, I guess one more. Just one more, you guys. We're almost done with this tour. This model proposes a terraforming and housing initiative on Mars, our closest neighbor in the solar system. This community is designed to draw on abundant water and counteract low temperatures, making human life possible on the red planet. It's like a whole little community on Mars. Needs coffee shops and street art. <laughs> this basically sums up everything we saw, but on a smaller scale. Realistically how it would be in Mars. That's pretty cool. Alright guys, let's get back to it. We derailed far enough. Come on, Finn. Locked. I recognize that kind of lock. If you shine a light at it, it'll open. The flashlights on our phones will work. But they won't reach. They will if we find a way to slide something reflective under the door. Something reflective. Oh, oh, I know, I know. You have Even to take one of these to models. Find something mutable. Mutable? You mean change its shape? Look at you breaking out the fancy vocab. <laughs> Shut up. Shape memory alloy. I could change the shape on the museum app. This stuff is crazy. Think it's a meta material? There you go. That's it. Take it. Don't let anyone see. Got it. Let's go. Wow. Oh, man. Oh. Sorry. All good. I still need something reflective. Wow. Look how the external tools interface directly with the command module's computer. We could recreate the idea, but with a neural interface. It would overload our central power. Not if we integrated it over the entire mesh from multiple entry points. Hmm. Do you think you can handle it? With enough time and a lot of coffee? Absolutely. <laughs> I'll supply the coffee. Well done, Peter. I couldn't do this without you. We should probably head back to the lab. We've overstayed our lunch break. Oh, Doc, I'm so sorry, but I've got to take the afternoon off. It's an emergency. Again? Peter, is something bigger going on? Perhaps at home? You know you can talk to me about it. I, I'm, I'm fine, but I'm sorry to run out on you again. Not at all. Work will be waiting when you get back. Thanks, Doc.
integration over the mesh. That boy's mind never stops. That's amazing, you guys. <laughs> so this is way before he even knew he was going to become the next Spider-Man. This is far, like... Uh, I think this is even before the whole feast. That's crazy. Who would have thought? Small world, huh? Small world. Wait, did we not take it? I thought we took the part. Oh, man. No, 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 we did. All right, hold on, you guys. I got so... Wait, what's this? Oh, hey, look. Solar mirrors. And sticky on the back. Perfect for tricking a light-sensitive lock. Take one. <laughs> I'll put the sticker on the metal. Let's go. Oh, it's a two-parter. Who would have thought? Nah, I didn't see that. I guess it wasn't a full tour, you guys. I'd like to you. Tell me when the sticker's pointed at the sensor, and I'll turn it on. No one's looking at us yet. Gotta hurry. Not suspicious at all. No, not quite. It's gonna be this one. Where is it at? Where is it at? I saw the little. Nope. Yeah, this one. Rotate it this way. A little more. There you go. Wait. Is it this one. Ah, oh, come on. Need something else. So I was right. I was just trying to aim at a thing already, though. That was awesome. I'm gonna miss doing stuff like this with you. What are you talking about? Uh, hello. You'll be at Brooklyn Visions next week. I won't. I'm not gonna vanish off the planet. We'll still hang out. You'll be busy. Not that busy. I'm gonna make time for us. Seriously. Okay. Ugh. This is getting mushy. Come on, let's head upstairs. That's the plan. Hey, Dad. Hey, Miles. Hi, Mr. Davis. Finn says hi. You kids having fun? Make sure you get a picture of your project. Dad, it's not a big deal. <clears throat> it's totally a big deal. Okay, okay, we'll get a picture. Love you, Dad. Bye. This is it. Our project's in the back. Hey. Think they got a converter all hooked up? Otherwise, what's the point? They'll need to feed biomass in, though. Maybe hook it up to a trash can. The Oscorp Tour 2.0. Positioned at one of two stable Lagrange points between Earth and the moon, could one day be a permanent home for human scientists and explorers. Man, it'd be so cool to live on a space station. Did anyone else ever get excited to go to like these type of museums? Like, I, I would always be excited. I just wasn't able to retain all the information. <laughs> Nuclear energy is the key to our future as we explore interstellar space. Fuel efficiency and transportation will be vital components in reaching and settling planets at the far reaches of our solar system and beyond. Oscorp nuclear reactor. Rick's working on something that's supposed to make nuclear energy obsolete. Do we get to know what it is? Nope. Roxxon's keeping it super secret. My ears are like, whoa, but my brain is like, huh? <laughs> Cultivating agriculture in neutral.
poetry and enriched fluids, what we call hydroponics, could make farming in space a reality. I wonder if they can grow flowers in space. They're probably more interested in food. Why? You trying to impress someone? I like to be prepared. In case I get a crush on a cute astronaut. <laughs> okay. Jealous? <laughs> this engine, used in the Apollo space program, is one of the most powerful inventions that uses liquid fuel. Today, Oscorp is building on that technology to maximize fuel efficiency, making deep space exploration possible. The most powerful single nozzle liquid fuel rocket engine ever made. I'd love to build something like that. Right? Oh man, this is too much. This is oh, too much rocket science for me. One of humanity's greatest accomplishments came from the Apollo space program. We reached the moon. Since then, scientists have dreamed of traveling beyond, and someday... Lunar module from the Apollo program. Hey, we can name our time capsule after that. How many Apollo missions were there? 16... 17, I think. Apollo 18. I like it. Our project. All right. I need to get that picture of you and our converter for your dad. Hold on. I'm barely going to look into it. Oh, wee! Would you look at that? Genuine award winning scientists. No one told us we were in the special exhibit. Ticket only. How'd you get in? Uh, I bought a ticket. How'd you get in? Not important. <laughs> hey, huddle up. We need a picture. You gotta be in it too. You helped us get it working. Okay, okay, fine, fine, fine. Scoot over. All right. Say alleles. I am not saying that. I am stuck. Do anything to him? Batter up. Oh, come on. This is my favorite museum. I know. What's wrong with you guys? Let's just finish him off as we go. I got stuck on the edge. 
That was an on me. Oh, this is left. What do I have? I shouldn't have done that. Oh, shoot. Alright, wanna play like that? I'll play like that then. Everyone's always talking about the other real Spider Man. What about me? I'm over here. Deal with me now. <laughs> Venom Dash! Venom Punch! Oh, did someone else pop out? No, not again. It's a lot easier when it's just a solo focus. Ah, uh, what? Ah, oh, what? I thought I got the finisher first. Out of here. Did I? You guys always tell me I mess with the wrong crew, but it seems like the right crew to me. Who else? Who else wants to Harlem now before Finn destroys the reactor? It's a race to the finish. Genki, talk to me. How's the evacuation going? Back. Rocks on an underground are all over. It's like a war zone. Are you safe, my mom? We made it. There was about a dozen people. You're breaking up. Who are you, Genki? If you can hear me. I'm on my way. Hang tight, man. Please. All right, you guys. I'm going to leave it at this. Uh, please leave a like and subscribe if you haven't. And as always, I'll catch you guys on the next episode.